Maybe the robot wasn't hostile after all. I'm pretty sure it was. It was about to inject neurotoxins into Green Texter. How she kicked the robot off the cliff just in time. Burger, stop being so paranoid. The robot was definitely hostile. It didn't perfect me with the new rock tokens. Not giving in to your demands is not a form of hostility. Hello, oven guy. Wait, there are more of you weird object things? Oh my flower! The robot is here! Robot, don't kill us! We've got too much to live for! Why would I want to kill you? I don't even know what you are. Isn't it obvious? I'm a cheeseburger! A cheeseburger with eyes, a mouth, arms and legs. Last time I checked, anthropomorphic cheeseburgers don't exist. Well, they do. Haven't you heard of us before? We were all over the news before the nuclear war happened. I don't remember anything about anthropomorphic objects being in the news. Hmm, let me see if I can recall a memory about you all. Did you hear? Zoe Sivian created these weird living object things. I guess I remember something about you all. But tell me, how do you even exist? You're inanimate objects, how can you even be alive? You're a piece of plastic and electronics. How are you alive? Well, we have organs inside of us. This object body is more like an exoskeleton. This stick is an exoskeleton? Green Texter, no chewing on sticks. You don't know where they have been. But I need the stick. Green Texter, why do you always have to act like you're four years old? Actually, you've been mistaken. I act like I am as old as the universe itself. Sure you do. But the atoms and energy within me was created when the universe was first formed. I am nothing more than a temporary collection of matter after all. She does have a point, however. What exactly is this whole perfect me with any rock tokens about? Well, burger. It doesn't really matter. Green Texter is prone to mishearing and she's a bit loopy. Do I look like a loop to you? You were created by Zoe Savian, right? Yes. Well, why did she create you? Do you have any object related powers? I can take my cap off and use my felt tip point to draw stuff. I don't really use it that often though. I use my felt tip a lot. Green Texter, what did I tell you about not drawing on trees? Well, a dynamite has to make sure she doesn't get too close to a fire. Otherwise her fuse will light and she will explode. So that's another ability I guess. You don't seem very useful. Wait, are there more of you? Yep, there are. Green Texter, give me back my cap. You've been acting very silly today. But this cap is mine. But it's not even the same colour as your body. Yes it is. But you're green and that cap is yellow. Prove to me it isn't the same colour. Um, look at that tree. It has green leaves. Now does my yellow cap have the same colour as those green leaves? The colour of them seem pretty similar. Just give me my cap back. I am just gonna continue to collect the water. The frame of the roof is almost complete now. Before long, we can start putting towels on the roof. Then the house will be finally finished. Which will be very exciting as I've been sick of sleeping inside a tent. Yes, Orange, what do you want? Why is Yellow Texter chasing Green Texter? Oh, she got Yellow Texter's cap. Not like I've seen her do that before. Why do you seem so tired? Did you have to run away from the robot? You come back here! Do you have any idea what they are doing? No, I don't. Green Texter, don't you dare go into Zoe's laboratory. Too bad, I'm going to dare myself to go into Zoe's laboratory. I dare myself to go into Zoe's laboratory. Well, I dared myself to go into Zoe's laboratory, so I'm going in there anyway. Why is Green Texter such a hassle? Why did Green Texter have your cap on? Who knows? Did, did the solar power pyramid start working again? It couldn't have. 